All right, and we're live here on the second day of the Mad City and Nerd Street Gamers 10K Championship. I'm going to be solo casting for the moment as we're allowing some of the other casters to get a little bit of sleep. So bear with me as I do this all alone right now, but I should have Darf Mike joining me soon. But the first match we're doing is Simplify versus Perplexed Gamers. And it looks like Simplify has already started at a 5-0 to oh record. And actually, if you look, just the first thing I notice is Toe Jerry is on negative one kills. Not a good look, bud. And you can see everybody else on the rest of his team. The top amount of frags they have is one, so they're going to have to turn that around, that around very quickly. Uh, but this is a buy round for them. You can see the SG on Toe Jerry. Let's see if they have some sort of uh, interesting strat here, a little bit of an execute. They're not going to go faster. They're going to take it slow. <clears throat> And on the Simplify side, you can see there's a little bit of aggression on the side of Simp in towards A main. So he has a bunch of map control that really gives them a little bit of extra info so they can adjust accordingly. But Laser Jesus, one of the casters here that's helped out in Mad City before, gets the opening kill with the AWP. And that's now one man advantage here for Simplify, who are looking good right now. 5 nothing, great start, but Noobopoly responds. And C7 goes down. So we're evened up 4v4. Perplex seems to want to go in towards A main. May have, have a pinch from mid, but here we go. D3 is going to get one, but doesn't get either of the other remaining players in towards A main. So D Fox is up next, grabs one, drops the bomb. Now 3v2 situation. And here comes the flag. J Cube grabs one. Last man standing is going to be San Flonzo. He's got to go up against three simplified players who already have control of the bomb. 45 seconds on the clock. And he's just trying to clear a few of these angles out here. See if he can maybe get a pick. He's spotted one, but J-Cube is going to win that battle. So six to nothing. Simplify looking good. And top fragger right now for Simplify is J-Cube, who's 8-0. <clears throat> And I'm wondering here if Perplex is going to go ahead and force up. They're on the border of a buy, so I don't think it would be a bad buy if they were to do so. But it'll look like they will be saving on pistols and armor. Get armor on Dave and Toe Jerry. And they're actually going to go, or at least try to go in towards mid quickly. But again, Laser Jesus opens it up. And that puts down Frotch. They're looking like they're trying to get mid control here, but it's just not working out. Laser Jesus, do it work. That's a double kill early in the round. Toe Jerry does respond with a nice deke to the face of D Fox. So that makes it a 4v2, a little bit of something to work with, but a lot of work left here to do in the seventh round. And Toe Jerry almost spots at the guy in towards Z. Laser Jesus wants more. That smoke will help out Toe Jerry, but he's going to uh, he's just going to go ahead and push through that smoke. Try to get in towards vents, but once he pops those vents, they're going to know what's up. And Laser G just doesn't seem to know he's in the area. And you can see the bomb wrapping in towards B. So it seems to be a, a retake situation here over towards the B site. There are men on a quick rotate and one guy in the back of Checker. So that's going to be C7 grabbing one, and J-Cube finishes it off. Seven to nothing. Simplify. Look great here. And a double there for Laser Jesus, who I'm hoping we can get on the mic later on. He's done a whole bunch of Mad City events in the past and uh, has a lot of good experience here for uh, casting. So hopefully we'll be able to get him on the mic and maybe uh, Mad Cow, who you saw on Cyclone GG, uh, pair them up. I think that would be a good matchup. And we're hoping to get some other uh, special guest casters here on the mic today as well. So maybe you guys will be seeing them later on. But it's the eighth round coming up. Full buy for per Perplex Gamers up on Nubopoly. And D Fox gets aggressive in towards Squeaky, pops a couple shots, but then he's going to go ahead, fall back, play it a little bit more conservative. But Noob Opoly is waiting, doesn't hit the shot. That would have been a nice opening, but whiffs the up shot. He's going to continue to stay in the same position, so that smoke doesn't deter him. It looks like Perpex, Glamer, Perpex Gamers want to uh, go over towards A. They're congregating in towards A main right now. So you can see the bomb over on the other side of Squeaky. I have a feeling he's probably setting up some sort of smoke execute here, potentially flashing his teammates. There's only one man in the A site, but there's a support player in D Fox coming up towards Highway, and here comes a full rotation. They're leaving one man over towards B, but everybody else coming over. 
And Sip is going to have to come up big. Excuse me, D3 is going to have to come up big. There's four men on the other side of that smoke. He spots one, but he's going to have his head taken off. Frotch opens it up. They're going to go ahead and try to plant that bomb. But Nubopoli able to grab on with the molly. So two men down here for Simplify. This could be the first round for Perplex. Nubopoli, that would have been a big kill there, but he whiffs. When that happens, C7 takes down Frotch. And it's now a 3v2. CT's coming back in this round. Dave lit up on 8 HP, but the bomb is ticking. There's a kit on both of these players, but Dave's in a pretty strong position here, dancing around quad box. Here comes the push by the CT's. A made support, but Laser Jesus grabs one. They know where the last man is. They're going to go ahead and molly up the bomb. Can they get the kill? But they, Laser Jesus can't push in because the molly's there, and he's going to have to try to YOLO this at the last second. I'm not sure if he's, if he's going to have time for this. He's going to try and stick it and he doesn't get it, barely. Nice attempt there on the retake by Simplify, but Perplex Gamers get their first on the board. Wow, that was a close one. Laser Jesus almost had that, but the uh, Molly ends up winning the round for him. Smart decision there, throwing that on the bomb, extending the time that it takes to defuse the bomb, and yeah, Perplex Gamers get their first on the board. So seven to one, Laser G just still on the up. And we have somebody joining us. Mr. Darf Mike is back. Oh, hello everybody. What's How's up, it man? going on this fine morning with a little a little fresh counter? It's fantastic. I'm doing a little solo casting. I feel like I'm at home. I've just uh, you know upgraded my gear a little bit. Upgraded just a wee bit. Just don't have a to mess bit. with the settings yourself. Someone else can do that. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. They're catering to me today. It's the I magic like it. of land. Someone else observes. Auto director got a whole lot better all of a sudden. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. We got Laser Jesus on the server. Yes, this, uh, I was talking about this earlier. We we're hoping to get him on the mic at some point, but right now it's looking like he might actually get into playoffs. Even though it's the first match, but he's l the team's looking pretty good. Seven to one. Good start for them. Yeah, some nice synergy here from the Laser Jesus. He's led his flock. Uh, through the the simplify seas, so it's been it's seven to one. Give give me the <coughs> give me the rundown. Has it been as dominant as the scoreline looks, or have these rounds been a little closer? Well, we st I started at five zero, um, but since I've jumped in, simplify's basically been dominant. There's been one round perplex gamers, actually literally just one. Uh, they mollied up the bomb over towards A, and they barely missed the defuse on the CT side. They finally got that kill towards A main. Um, so they snuck around on Perplex Gamers, but if they lose this, they're going to be in a whole bunch of trouble. Looks like it's going to be an execute on towards the B side. J-Cube, who's been really dominant up to this point, is able to grab one, and then the rest of his teammates can do the work. And that's going to be an easy-peasy round for Simplify as Perplex Gamers just gets shut down on the push towards B. Yeah, the error there was not clearing checkers. As soon as they don't clear checkers, C7 is tucked in there. If they drop a molly there, they can get an e easy frag, but they devote the molly towards headshot instead, and it doesn't quite land where you were hoping, and it's just the, the round's completely over because they're just entrenched in perfect positions, able to frag. C7 is on 14-1. and one. Wow. Yeah, he's been impressive so far. I mean, basically everybody on the side of Simplify is just doing work, but here comes the push in towards mid, but again, CT's just... Running right through them. They dropped the bomb. It is able to be secured here in a second, but Laser Jesus is going to grab one. D3 adds one as well. Sanflanzo, last man standing in a 4v1 situation. All he has is a P250 in a dream. Now this, I mean, it's an eco round, right? But it seems like this has kind of been the tale of most rounds. Push into sight, get smacked. And uh, unfortunately, if you can't do any of the smacking back, Perplex is just going to have a really rough time getting anything done in this map. Uh, so Ooh. Frotch, the only one who's, <coughs> who's really doing anything with the 6 and 10, and two players on the double O. Yeah, oh, can we see the uh, leaderboard real quick? Yeah, Darf just pointed out. Mm. Toe, Jerry, and Dave struggling a little bit here. Neither of them have a kill just yet, so Frotch, is got, he's on six kills, and he's the highest fragger right now. The closest one to that is on two, so Ooh. that's got to change if they want to get back into this map. Yeah, Toe, Jerry needs to learn from his, uh, his brother, Finger Jerry, and uh, up his <laughs> game a little bit. <laughs> I like that. Should have brought him on land here, man. I want to have Tojeri and Just Bob in the same server. There you go. But yeah, action going on towards the A site. CT is going to clean up. Easy shut down of the push on towards B. And yeah, Perpex Glamers, they have a, have a buy there, but r only able to get one kill. So they're struggling here to really come up with anything that's successful, it seems like. Yeah. And uh, 10, 11 rounds in, sitting on the 0 0. That's a rough time. He's going to break out the Krieg. Toe Jerry hoping to channel the magic powers of NBK. NBK, of course, has just committed a coup d'etat. 
and eliminated the Shoxy. So we're going to see if, if that power will translate into his Krieg and roll right through. I was sh shocked you were when shocked I saw that. Yeah, yeah, I've, I've been saving that one up. <laughs> so, yeah, that was an interesting, deci uh, interesting decision they made. It'll be cool to see how it works out, but, I mean, losing a player like Shox, that's, uh, that's tough, no doubt about it. We'll see if Mixwell can uh, fill in his shoes pretty well. If it works out, I vote that we now call the Krieg the Kingmaker. Yeah. <laughs> I'm on board with that. Let's yeah. make it happen. All right, so Toe Jerry porting the Kingmaker, going to try and clear a little bit of space towards mid. He's up there with New Bopoli, but they've been smoked out, and there's really no ground to gain. Two players waiting for them, one in vents, one up highway, and again, they've just had so much difficulty taking any sort of map control without just throwing bodies at it and losing numbers. So Perplex really need to get an opening pick here. Sunflonzo, presumably the player to make that happen, but he's not really in a position to do so, and he's going to get caught out trying to go for that on the boost. So they've already lost their Opper, and now the Flash is decimating as Simp can just take ground. Actually, the D3, D3 can just take ground, swinging around the forklift. They've really not been tested at all. And again, a peek into mid with no utility behind it is just going to wind up with Nubopoly dead in the dirt. There's nothing going well for them whatsoever. It's just single peaks, dry peaks. They're not peeking with these flashes. Finally, a flash comes out, but I think it's from the CT side. Dave will get one, having just finally hemmed D3 into a corner, but now he's going to get oh. run down, reloading in the middle of open space. Yeah, that's a tough uh, position there to reload, especially when you know these guys are being somewhat aggressive on the side of Simplify. So he gets caught out reloading. Perplex gamers are perplexed as to what they should do at this point. And I'm not entirely sure. If I was in the server, I would be know what to do. I think at some point, maybe just YOLO B and hope for the best. Well, they did YOLO B that one round where they forgot to molly checkers, and they got YOLO oh. wrecked. Uh, they, so they checked that one off, and that didn't work. So, yeah. you know, they got back to the drawing board, boys. Honestly, if, if they, mm, deep smokes, deep flashes, and just charge main, mid, maybe. But it seems like they they have a hesitancy to commit. Uh, so Dave going to be picking up the hero buy here, but the rest of his team's on the pistols. And now Sunflonzo, the first victim to fall to the wrath of Simplify. They will simplify their roster by removing a player from it. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, 5v4, Sunflonzo down. They're looking like they want to get over towards him. They've got a guy in towards Squeaky who's spotted out too, but that means the CTs have seen him, and he goes down. That's two down for Perplex Gamers. And now 5v2 situation. At this point, they've taken 7 HP off of D3, and uh, they've traded three players to do so. So it's really just there is no toehold for Perplexed in this round. There's no toehold at all in this game. They're just getting annihilated round after round after round with clinical precision from Simplify. I, I don't see a silver lining here. I think we're going to have a pretty pretty quick game. Yeah, pretty uh, pretty quick here. I'm hoping Perplex can get a few more rounds on the board, and you can see right now Toe Jerry struggling hard, still on zero. Dave got a kill. Dave right, got a hey, kill. Hey, maybe that's the point where they're able to turn it around here. Golf Build clap. up your confidence a little bit. Golf clap, Dave. I'm with that. Golf clap from both of us. Anyways, looks like it's going to be a B, con uh, a B control call here. Over towards B main now for the T side. You can see a nice little setup here by the CTs, though. JQ waiting. He's got a support player there in C7. And here comes Frotz. He's going to be the first man in. Molly, perfect setup there. Doesn't allow the T's to get in towards Checker, and that's going to get C7 with the opening kill. They drop the bomb. Nubopoli up next. Whiffs the off shot. That's now 5v2. C7 is lit up on 8 HP, but you can see the CT's are on the hunt. You notice they're trolling at this point because C7, I think, flashed his own teammate in CT to prevent him from being able to grab a kill. Um, I think that I'm pretty sure that was intentional in trolling. So uh, it's sort of reflects the mood in this team. This is the best chance that Perplexed have had in a round since I started watching, and they're in a 2v3, and one of their players has 2 HP. It's a Krieg and an Omp to try and make something happen. The Nade will find Simp, so they brought numbers equal, but it is just going to be Laser Jesus tucked into the corner, and Toe Jerry is watching him like a hawk. Smoke goes down. Actually, in this context, it may not have helped them too well, but they do need to get that bomb planted. 40 seconds on the clock, and oh. a player in heaven. They're not even going to check it. He'll just <laughs> rain down chaos from above. Defox with the frags. Hey, that was a good round there for Toe Jerry. He gets two kills with the SG and oh, gets Jerry. the nade kill. So he's on three. He's, you know, climbing the board. He's second on the board now. <laughs> with three. Having Eight. gotten three kills in a round. Good job, Toe Jerry. Golf clap. Golf clap. <clears throat> so 13 to one. Last round of this first half. It's going to be a force up, as you can imagine, on the side of Perplex. But they end up getting a pretty good buy here. They come up short on New Bobbley's utility. But other than that, I mean, they got plenty of utility for an execute. Good firepower. And there we go. We get the opening kill for Soflanzo. 
And there's going to be a CT player pushing on the other side of the smoke. That might have been there a mistake because that opens up the B site. Here's the round. They got the trades. They got to check Heaven. No one's watching Heaven. I don't know what the responsibility is here, but they've just, they're giving too much ground in Heaven. Laser Jesus plucks a kill. Meanwhile, in from the vents, it's just destruction raining down. Frotch now last alive, and he'll get annihilated. He was looking good for a moment there, but on their takes, they're just a little too sloppy. There's not the coordination to check every angle. So that's going to be the end of the half, and I've got to say, this half has made me really glad that I'm here on the mic and not in the server, because I'd be that guy at 0015. Yeah, dot quit. Yeah. Yeah, dot just disconnect. Rage quit and smash the monitor. Yeah. Flip the table. <laughs> walk away. Well, it's a good thing you're not in the server. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm a really sad. Uh, when, I, when I'm, when i like, down in the server, I just get quiet and sad. Yeah. It's not a rage thing. It's, it's just everybody a, it's just, out. It's just sorrow. Yeah, single tear, maybe. Single tear, gently rolling down my cheek. I feel that. I've been there. I'm more of a rage guy. I you're a rage guy. Yeah. I try not to be, but it's sometimes the, the Hulk just comes out, man. No, I get you. Those uh those matchmaking kiddos they get they get the worst out of you. Yeah. So pistol round coming up. Simplify looking to lock down map point here, and actually a little bit of aggression on the side of the CT side. You can see one's already got in towards Sunroom, and it looks like it's going to be a B push from Simplify. So good setup here by the CTs, but Newbopoli's got to get some kills, and that does not happen. D Fox opens it up. Some Flanzo's up next. He's already down to 18 HP. Sprotch here coming in towards Vent for support. And there we go. That's one. Make Ooh. it two for the CT side. And now a 3v3 situation after C7 drops one. Some Flanzo is lit up, though. He has the bomb, though. This is a potentially strong position if his teammates can get in to support him. But Toe Jerry just jumping around on Heaven is not going to get anything done. Now it all comes down to Dave. Dave has a kit, two flashes, and a dream. But he's not even get, He's got to use those flashes. He's got to use those flashes to bait some of these peaks. He has utility. Now is the time to use it. Two players are about a bullet away from death. And he's just going to go ahead and try and frag. Can catch somebody on the cross if Defox chances it. He will, but he'll miss this shot. Laser Jesus C7 and Defox now just can toy with him as they go into their post plant. And he's got to move out, and he'll get double peeked off the back of that, and it's instant death for Dave. Yep, so map point coming up. Simplify can put this one away and get their first win of this tournament on the board. Let's see if Perplex Gamers can run 14 in a row. Tough road ahead of them, I believe. But, hey, oh, hey, Dave got his first kill. I don't know. I don't know when that happened, but Dave had it a while ago. Toe Jerry, I thought Toe Jerry was the last one on on zero. Oh, was it Toe Jerry that was the last yeah, one? Yeah, because then he got that three. And then K, he got three in a row, and it was uh, like, uh, man, Toe Jerry, only impact frags. Except they didn't win that round. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I got a little something for you there, but uh, simplify. Looks like they're trying to get a little bit of mid control here. Froch is hanging over towards highway at the five seven, but here comes C seven on the hunt. Able to grab one, Frotch, nothing he can do about that back turn, and that's a shot to the back of the head. C7 looking to continue to extend in towards the A site. Four guys coming up towards highway, and JQ will add one. Toe Jerry waiting for somebody to push on towards the Raptors, but D3 is going to get the kill anyway. Can't do much with that P250. And Nubopoli is the last man standing for per perplexed, and that will be it. Simplify win in a very impressive fashion, 16-1. to one. That was like taking the old family dog out back behind the shed and, and, and putting them to sleep. Uh, they, they let it go. Uh, they, they, they were just merciless. There was no quarter given. Just, just a savage. Just complete just, savagery. They're just uh, exerting their dominance here in the start of the tournament. So everybody's got to be watching out for them. When I was looking at the group, I wasn't entirely sure if Simplify was going to be a good team, but that's a great start and you know give us uh, an idea of what type of play we'll be able to see from them the, the end of this tournament.